come downstairs. It's time for dinner. Ooh, there's one downstairs, a rotten egg. Hey, Billy, wait. What? <laughs> nice throw. Thanks. There is no way I was going to let Billy win. He's the only rotten egg in this house. Come on, let's hurry up and beat him downstairs. All right, I'm right behind you. Hey, that wasn't fair. You guys cheated. Wait for me. Oh, well, you snooze, you lose, Billy. That wasn't fair. You guys cheated. And I can still beat you to the table. What? Yes, I was the first one to the table. I made it here second. Hold on, hold on, I'm here. I'm telling mom, you guys cheated. Oh man, what's that smell? Tommy, do you smell it? Oh man, you're right. It does smell. What are you guys talking about? I don't smell nothing. You know what it smells like? It smells like a rotten egg. <laughs> Billy, get away from the table, you stink. <laughs> It's not funny. I am not a rotten egg. And I'm telling mom, you guys are gonna get in so much trouble. Okay, dinner is served. Huh? Tommy, Michael, here's your food. Thanks, mom. Mom, Tommy and Michael keep teasing me. They said I smell funny and I smell like a rotten egg. How many times do I have to tell you boys? Stop messing with your brother. Now both of you aren't allowed on your Xbox for the rest of the night. <laughs> oh man, are you kidding me? Mom, we were just messing with them. Uh, thanks a lot, Billy. I was supposed to play Fortnite with my friends tonight. And here you go, Billy. Here's your dinner. Thanks, Mom. It looks so good. Oh, you're welcome, sweetie. And I even cut it up into little pieces for you. Just how you like it. Maybe next time you could chew it up and spit it into his mouth. Like a baby bird. That's not funny, Michael. Mom! Did you hear what he said? Michael, I told you to knock it off. Now after dinner, get right up to your room. You're grounded for the rest of the night. Fine. Totally worth it though. <laughs> Yo, I know mom said you're not allowed to have dessert, so I snuck this up for you. Here. Oh sweet, brownies, my favorite. Thanks, Tommy. I can't even believe you got punished for that. You didn't even do anything. I know, tell me about it. We can't just let them get away with it. We gotta teach them a lesson. Well, I do got one idea, but we might get grounded for the rest of our lives. So, we already get punished for nothing. I'd rather make it worth it. What's your plan? Two words, prank war. Sold, I'm in. I had a feeling you were gonna say yes, so I decided to spice things up. I called grandma and told her what we were gonna do. And she said whoever pulls the best prank on Billy wins $10,000. No way, are you serious? Grandma's gonna give the best prankster $10,000? I would've did it for free. I know, me too. Grandma must hate Billy just as much as we do. That probably explains why she always throws a flip flop at his head for no reason. Let's get started. Let the best prank win. Okay, I got Billy's shampoo. Time to add a special ingredient. Some green hair dye. <laughs> Whoa! No way! I just got an ultra rare pet on Adopt Me! <laughs> Perfect. Now all I gotta do is put it back and sit back and wait. I better go see what Michael's up to. Oh. Hey, Billy. What are you doing down here? Oh. What are you doing out of your room? Aren't you supposed to be grounded? <laughs> I am grounded, thanks to you. But mom said I could leave my room. So I wanted to come sit down on the couch. Fine, whatever. Just don't bother me. I'm trying to play Roblox. Don't worry. I'm not going to bother you. Oh, I finally found you all. What are you guys doing? Jeez, what is this, a family reunion or something? Calm down. I just wanted to spend quality time with my brothers. Do you mind if I join you guys? Fine, whatever. You can sit down with us. Just don't bother me. I'm trying to play Roblox. Thanks. 
I'm Tommy. Watch this. It's time for phase one of my plan. Okay, I'm excited. I can't wait to see what you came up with. Man, I'm so upset I got punished after dinner, and I didn't get to eat dessert. Mom said she got ice cream cake for us. Huh? Ice cream cake? I didn't get any ice cream cake, and ice cream cake is my favorite. Really? That's weird. Maybe she's just saving it for later. Really? Why would she save that for later? I'm gonna go see if I can have some right now. <laughs> okay, good luck. I gotta hurry up and make this quick before he finds out there's no ice cream cake. Pay attention. You're watching a master at work. So was that your prank? To tell Billy that we had ice cream cake so you could get his phone? Oh, uh, this is just step one of my prank. I'm looking up a bunch of bad stuff on Billy's phone. That way when mom looks at it, he gets in trouble. No way, that's genius. Not only is it a prank, but you're gonna get him grounded too. Thanks, I know. And that's not even the best part. Wait till phase two. I think I hear him coming back. Act natural. Hey! That wasn't very nice. We didn't have any ice cream cake. Ah, uh, sorry about that, Billy. I thought mom said there was ice cream cake. You're probably just still mad I got you grounded. And really, was that the best you can come up with? Telling me there's ice cream cake when there's no ice cream cake? Well, guess what? The joke's on you! Because mom's taking me out later to get ice cream. <laughs> yeah, we'll see about that, Billy. Now sit there and leave me alone! I'm trying to play Roblox! <laughs> okay, get back to playing Roblox. Okay, good. My friend's still on. You're lucky. Whoa, did you hear that one, Tommy? I'm lucky his friend's still online. Ooh, I'm shaking in my boots. Man, you are lucky. I was getting scared for you for a second. <laughs> okay, time for phase two. Watch this. Mom! Mom, can you come in here real quick? Yeah, what do you want, Michael? Oh, never mind, Mom. I forget what I was gonna ask you. Oh, okay. And Billy, it's almost time for you to get off the game. You gotta go get in the shower in a little bit. And if any of you boys need me, I'll be in the other room. Are you ready for this? No! You're the one that needs a shower, Mom! You smelly, stupid head! Wait, what? <gasps> Excuse me? What did you just say, Billy? I think he just called you a stupid head, Mom. No, Mom, it wasn't me! I promise! It was Michael! Nice try, Billy, but it wasn't Michael. I know the sound of your voice. You better not talk to me like that ever again! Do you understand? Yay! Yeah, it wasn't me, Billy. I can't believe you would try to blame me for that. Okay, okay, I'm sorry! It won't happen again! I'll be back in a little bit, and your attitude better change. Yeah, well, the only one that needs a new attitude adjustment is you! You big fat idiot! <gasps> oh, Cocomelons! William! Billy! Joseph! I can't believe you would talk to me like that! Where did you even learn that language from? Yeah, Billy, what's wrong with you? Mom, I think I know where you learned that language from. I saw him watching R-rated videos on his phone. Oh, really? Thanks for telling me, Michael. What? No, I wasn't. I promise. Billy, let me see your phone right now. Fine, here, take it. That'll prove to you I'm telling the truth. Okay, let's see. <laughs> Oh my goodness, it's true! Billy, why were you watching these things? I can't believe it! Wait, are you serious? There's actually bad things on my phone? <laughs> oh, Cocomelons, I was set up! You know what? You're grounded. You're not allowed to have your phone for the next three months. And I'm telling your father when he gets home from work. Three months? Are you serious? That's not fair! Now get upstairs and get in the shower! And while you're in there, wash your mouth out with soap! Fine! I'll go take a shower! <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe that actually worked! He got punished for three months! <laughs> and he's gonna be in even more trouble when Dad gets home! <laughs> that was awesome! Well, one of my pranks should be happening within the next ten minutes. Man, this stinks! I can't believe I got in trouble! Maybe a nice warm shower will help me get my mind off of things! Scrub is 
scrub, scrub, scrub and dub and dub. Oh yeah! Ah, that's better. Okay, time to brush my hair. Well, sounds like my prank worked. Hey, which one of you did this to me? <laughs> Look out, Michael, it's a leprechaun. <laughs> hey, Cosmo, where's Wanda at? <laughs> it's not funny. Stop laughing. You guys are going to get in so much trouble. You better hope this washes out. <laughs> <laughs> Good luck trying to wash it out, Mosshead. <laughs> Dude, that was epic. I guess great minds think alike. Thanks, man. I knew that would make you laugh. What do you mean great minds think alike? You'll find out in a little bit. Okay. I can't believe they would do this to me. They better pray this comes out of my hair. But this time, I'm going to use Michael's shampoo. <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna use the whole bottle. That should get all the green out. All right, I'm done. That had to have worked. Now let's see. Sounds like you'll be finding out what I meant any second. Are you friggin' kidding me? <laughs> it's Ronald McDonald. <laughs> Orphan Annie! <laughs> Once again, this is not funny! I have to go to school tomorrow! I can't go looking like this! <laughs> you look like you should be singing It's a Hard Knock Life for us! <laughs> Stop it! Stop making fun of me! <laughs> Calm down, Chucky! It was just a prank! <laughs> See? I told you great minds think alike. I can't believe he fell for that prank twice. Yeah, he really isn't the smartest, is he? I got another prank we can play on him, but I need your help getting him in the car. All right, no problem. I doubt he's gonna trust us, though. It's Billy we're talking about. He's an idiot. Trust me, we can get him in the car. Hey, Billy, you in here? Yeah, what do you want? Listen, me and Michael feel bad for what we did, so we were gonna go to McDonald's and we were gonna see if you wanted to go. We'll buy you a Happy Meal. Yeah, and we can even stop for ice cream on the way home. Really? You buy me a Happy Meal and ice cream? Yeah, and we can even stop at the salon on the way home. That way we can get the orange out of your hair. Okay, I'll go. All right, I'll go get the keys. We'll meet you out in the car. All right, is everybody ready? Let's go. Yeah, I'm ready. Let's go. I'm so excited. Hey, wait a second. Where are we going? We just passed McDonald's. Oh yeah, that's because we're going to a new McDonald's out of town that just opened up. It's way cooler than our McDonald's. Whoa, really? A new McDonald's? Sweet. This is gonna be awesome. Yeah, don't worry. We'll be there in a little bit. Hey, Billy, can you do me a favor? Can you smell the back seat for me? Some girl sprayed perfume on it, and I tried to get the smell out. Seriously? A girl sprayed perfume on the back of your seat? Yeah, I'll smell it to see if you got the smell out. Oh! <laughs> Sorry, Billy. A squirrel ran in the middle of this street. <laughs> oh, whatever. And by the way, no, it doesn't smell like perfume. I think you got the smell all out. Oh no, Michael, do you feel that? I gotta pull over. Oh no, I feel that too. Wait, what's wrong? Why are you pulling over? I think we got a flat tire. Billy, can you get out and look? Oh no, are you serious? A flat tire all the way out here? We're so far away from home. Okay, I'll go check. Okay guys, I checked. It doesn't look like we have a flat tire. Uh, what are you guys doing? Unlock the door. Sorry, can't do that, Billy. See you later, Billy. Harry, Tommy, go, go, go. Wait, what? Are you guys serious? Have fun walking home. <laughs> Wait, guys, no. We're like a 10-hour walk home. Get back here. <laughs> Look how fast he's running. <laughs> Guys, stop! Stop! <laughs> I 
I've never seen Billy run so fast. Well, at least we don't have to deal with Billy for a couple of hours. Wanna really go get McDonald's? Heck yeah, I could go for some McDonald's. All right, let's go. <sighs> oh, hey, Billy, you're home. Yeah, I can't believe it. And it only took you six and a half hours. I can't believe I made it home either. That was the hardest walk of my life. And every single car that drove by was making fun of me. And a couple of them even threw drinks and food at me. <laughs> Man, I wish I could have seen that. <laughs> why do you guys keep messing with me? Are you serious? You don't know why? It's because you're always telling on us and getting us in trouble. We needed to get payback on you. That's why? Fine. Listen, let's just call the truce. I'll never get you guys in trouble again. Just please stop pranking me. All right, that works. As long as you stop getting us in trouble, we'll stop pulling pranks on you. Thanks, guys. Now I've got to get to bed. I am so friggin' tired. I'll see you guys in the morning. All right, have a good sleep. So, who won the $10,000? I don't know. I say we just split it. Here, here's 5000 Sounds fair. Thanks. Ah, oh, finally. I can get some sleep. Uh-oh, I just forgot. I set up one more prank for Billy. Really? What prank? <laughs> Vote down in the comments who you think had the best prank and deserves to win all $10,000. And we want to give a big shout out to all of our subscribers and all the members that joined the Zippy family. See you later, everybody. Thanks for watching. And make sure to remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And turn your notifications on. Peace.